your boy Spider-Man is back with another tutorial. Today guys I'm going to be showing you how to confuse your uh, project thing tool so people can't crack it. I mean they can crack it but it's going to be a lot harder for them to do it. So yeah guys, let's get into it. So what you want to do is open up the confuser. That ESX, I'll leave the download in the description. So you're going to want to open it. Wait for it to open. It's going to open. You're going to get like a big thing on your screen like this. Yes, like this. So once you have that like that, you're going to want to open up your project thing. Go to like your thing, your bin, your debug. And you want to create another folder like I did right here. So then you're gonna want to go to this bin debug, and then you want to drop the thing. So you want to drop the application, drop the application, the material skins you're gonna need, like all the DLLs you're gonna need to drop there. So yeah, like that. So then that's gonna what you're gonna have left over. And then we'll close that out. You're gonna want to open up this. Once it, you're in a new folder, open up your other folder like this. Drop those two things in here. It should pop up like this. And then you want to hit generate debug symbols. You want, it's a must. You must generate debug symbols. So then, you go to settings and you see packer. And then you just don't see nothing. So you click packer. And make sure it's on compressor. If it's not, then I don't know. Just, yeah, it should be on compressor. Then click protect. It'll do all this shit here. Wait for it, it might take a couple minutes, so. Alright, guys, almost done here. So, alright, guys, it's done. So, now your tool is protected. So, yeah, guys, if you like this tutorial, please drop a like and subscribe if you're new. Peace out.